Can we actually compile this? Let's try. Wow, compile successfully. Alright, nice. Let's get to the video. Hello, Assalamualaikum and good day to all. I'm Ahmad Koyu Fikri bin Ahmad Jazimin. You can call me Koyu. And with my partner, my lab partner, Shakira binti Abdul Aziz. So today, um, we are going to share and explain our uh, lab x86 emulator, um, lab week 8. Alright, so let's get to it. Okay, so uh, by the way, am I recording? Alright, sweet. So, um, this is our code from line 1 to line 10. So, first of all, if you want to run this code, you need to assign variable. So, Alright, so let's start with the first number. Let's assign the number, uh, let's give it 50. Alright. The, the second number, let's give it, uh, you know, uh, perhaps uh, 80, 85. Nah, nah, let's keep it 80. Okay. So, by the way, here the number is 32 and here 50. Why? Because this number is in hexadecimal. And yeah, this is the number that if um, uh, you want to see in decimal, you know, you can just click those numbers. So, the first number just now is um, 50 plus 80. Plus 50 plus 80 Hold on yeah 50 plus 80 Plus um, Alright 50 plus 80 Okay so the third number Let's assign the third number alright So let's give the value 20 mm -hmm. And let's proceed to the Fourth number Let's give it you know Let's give it uh, 10 <coughs> Alright, okay, so let's give it 10. Okay, so uh, and the last variable, the last variable is average. Um, this is 0 because initial value, right? So it will not have value, you know. Let's just keep it 0 and let's reset those values. All right, so this is um, our value here, right here, and you know we can actually start to run the code. So let's run the code. Click run, and tada! All right, so we see the value over here is twenty eight. If we wanted to, you know, if we wanted to. Um, check the, the, the answer is in decimal we can yeah click it and yeah it's 40 all right so it is true okay so the value at average here change so here first value 32 in hexadecimal yeah 32 plus a plus 50 plus 14 all of these uh, we add all those together in hexadecimal and we divide it by 4 because we want to find the average, right? So the value is 28 in hexadecimal. And if you want to change those number, this is in decimal. Alright, nice. Okay. So these are how we are going to execute. This is how we execute. Um probably you guys want to know how the code uh, operates execute uh, line by line let's get to it so let's reset these values and let's go line by line so let's start in line 3 so eax eax so what we do what we actually do in first line we set eax to 0 so yeah it's clear okay so next line move ex first so we add first variable to ex so we have this ex we add the variable uh, we we actually move right we move we insert 
inside ax so our val our first value is 50 in decimal and in hexadecimal it is 32 in hexadecimal so second line is the same thing we add 10 in decimal and the third line we add the third va uh, third, third value uh, 80 on and the fourth step all right we add 20 so you, you guys can also see here it is actually increasing right so we are actually adding those numbers so we I click next so it so this is the all the addition all the summation of all four numbers 160 in decimal and here we actually set the divider to 4 this is for um, this line is to tell the program to tell the computer to actually take all these four values and divide those value by four but this is not yet in the division section all right this is just to tell um, what is the divider what is the divisible value so it is four right there and next step it is a divide divide division division operation so we use the line div cx so divide and store the average at ax okay so and the last line that we execute is we move average every time we see the word move in assembly language in this code it actually um you know uh, execute uh, all, 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 all the value yeah it execute uh, it changed the value of the x so we get our answer already so that's how we um, do in this lab so i guess that's all from me in part a in part b my partner shakira will explain it and if you guys have any question make sure to hit me up and inshallah if uh, I, uh, we can discuss together uh, I guess that's all from me for today um, Thank you and Assalamualaikum Bye-bye